It's Tuesday the 22nd of October, a pretty standard parliamentary day, although the, there's a number of bills where it's quite unpredictable how long they'll take, so we're not quite sure of the progress that's going to be made. But like most days, we start off with questions. Uh, the first one is Deborah Russell to the Minister of Finance uh, about reports on the New Zealand economy. Simon Bridges to the Prime Minister, does she stand by all her government's policies and statements? Uh, Paul Goldsmith to the Minister of Finance, uh, does he stand by all of his statements and actions? Uh, Jan Tanetti uh, to the Minister of Education about young people getting into, into the trains. Uh, Jamie Lee Ross to the Minister of Transport uh, about park and ride facilities in Botany. Judith Collins to the Minister of Housing about Kiwi Build. Marama Davidson to the Minister for Social Development. Uh, about benefit levels uh, and debt of beneficiaries. Uh, Louise Upston to the Minister of Social Development about the hardship allowance and changes in that. Chris Bishop to the Minister of Transport, whether he stands by all his statements and policies. Jamie Strange uh, to the Minister of Health about mental health announcements relating to the Waikato. Uh, Brett Hudson to the Minister of Police uh, about uh, new police and meeting targets. And Shane Retty to the Associate Minister of Health uh, about uh, measles. We will then have uh, an unusual debate, a one-hour debate, uh, led off by Julianne Genta, uh, noting the centenary of women winning the right to stand for Parliament. So there was quite a period of time uh, after women got the vote in New Zealand but were not eligible to be MPs. Then we'll have the third reading of the Corrections Amendment Bill in the name of Kelvin Davis. Uh, the Legislation and Legislation Repeals and Amendments Bill, third reading, uh, in the name of the Honourable David Parker. Um, this is a, an update of the Legislation uh, Act. Uh, the Criminal Cases Review Commission Bill, second reading in the, in the name of Andrew Little. Uh, a group of bills in the committee stages, uh, sort of, the, I think it might be the third crack at these. Uh, there are bills to do with uh, regulations involving uh, economic development. And then if we get to it, uh, the organ donors and related matters bill, uh, the interrupted uh, second reading. So Parliament will sit from uh, 2 till 6, from 7.30 till 10, and we'll back, be back here again tomorrow.